Hey everybody, how's it going? What's today? Thursday. Thursday the 13th or 14th? 13th. Today is Thursday the 13th and it is 8.06 a.m. Miles and myself are going out for a morning walk. We didn't go on one yesterday. Because we are just tired from the from the trip to Manila. Hey, we spent from 9 p.m. on the 10th until what time did we get home yesterday? The night before on the 11th? 10th. Until 9 p.m. on the 11th in a van. And whew, I'll tell you, man, we went we want the immigration in Manila. That was the easy part. I was in and out of there within five, ten minutes. All they did, I thought it was like an interview, a sit-down type deal. No, it wasn't. Uh, went in there, walked inside the door, and I was like, oh, man, I'm going to be here for a while. Nope. Since we had a, uh, we used the agency, we were escorted, Miles, myself, we were escorted to the front of the line, which at first I felt really bad. We got some dirty looks from people <laughs> because they were sitting there. there. was, I talked to one one guy, uh, gentleman, I think he was, he was a US. US. All right, he got there at between 4.30 and five o'clock in the morning. All right, and he was still waiting. I got there, what time, my point was at 11. We got there, what, 10.30? Around 10.30 in the morning. And they took us right away. And I was, we were on our way out by 10.45. Everything was done. Boom, boom, boom. And I was, ta I talked to the American guy and he was Illinois, like. Illinois guy. They were noise? Yeah. Okay. I talked to him real quick. And he was like, who the hell, who the hell did I know to get in so quickly? And I told him, I said, I used an agency. He said, you know. I, th I figured this would be easier because I was definitely wrong. <laughs> I wish I used an agency. What was the name of the agency? RNG. RNG Travel oh, Agency out of Badak, man. I'll tell you, if you ever want to, if you got to ever get, try to get some type of visa, uh, 13A, and you live in the Locos Norte region, man, use them. I guess she got the right. She has the right hookups because, well, like I said, man, we were in and out. And the American guy was there to do the same exact thing I was, and he was still sitting there waiting. So it helps. It helps for an agency. I mean, yeah, you pay thirty thousand pesos, but I'm gonna be honest with you, thirty thousand pesos is almost about five hundred something dollars. But uh, at the end of the day, it was worth it. At least I think it was. Now the van ride, that was a round trip. It was what, an eight hour drive one way? Yeah, about eight hours. Manila at two o'clock. Right here. Yeah. yeah, so it was an eight hour round trip. Well, I'm sorry, eight hours one way, and it cost us 5,000 pesos each for miles and 5,000 for me. Was it worth it? Yeah, because it was door to door service. And I'm pretty sure if I went by myself or if I, me and Miles went. probably took a heck of a lot longer as far as without an agent or all means of transportation it took a heck of a lot longer because they had a, a driver that he sat so no matter where we stopped or parked he sat in the vehicle so he could basically park anywhere and if you ever been to Manila <laughs> Open in Manila. It's just like parking 
find a parking spot in like New York or LA or anything like that, man, good luck. <laughs> so. <coughs> So we are, we turn out good. Now they tell us how long it's gonna take. Two to three months. Two to three months. Why so long, I have no idea. So, I had to do one more visa extension just to be on the safe side. I don't want them to find a reason. I don't want them to come up with a reason why they need to deport me. So in November, I'll do another visa extension. Nah. Hopefully, I'll be good to go. Hopefully. Think of the worst and hope for the best. That's all I can say. Yeah, I still got the cold. It's not as bad as it was. The only problem is now Miles has it. The only problem is there's certain medications that she can't take that I was taking, so. And she'd rather just ride it out and see what happens. Do I feel for Oh yeah, man, I had it. You feel so miserable. Everything aches. You got a headache. Joint aches. No, it's not, it's not the, the C. Sore throat. Yeah, sore throat. You want to stop at the pharmacy and see if they got anything that you could take? Still have good one, don't For your, how about you, for your sinuses? Yeah, I know I didn't upload a video yesterday. We were just... Went to bed, fell asleep, what? Tonight we got home, <coughs> fell asleep around 11. Well, Miles was asleep before then. And uh, got up around seven o'clock. Oh, they're back to work on that. Yeah. They will put another floor. Yeah. Looks like they're putting a skim coat on the first floor. But I could be wrong, man. I don't know how they do. They finish it. They one will work. You want to get any kind of orange juice or anything like that? What? I don't know. It's the store. They got enough sorry sorry stores around here. Okay. Right? Yeah, sorry sorry shit everywhere. Okay. Let's... Yeah, it's been raining. Rained all day yesterday. Looks like it's gonna rain today. Which is fine with me.
All right, hey, I'll let you all go. We're gonna smart Miles. Gonna get some orange juice. And y'all have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye.